this video is going to show you how to install BMW Impa on a Windows 10 computer. You need to be logged in as an administrative account and you can search for Beamer Geeks downloads. Click on the first link. Click on standard tools. And then you can go ahead and download as a zip this uh, seven zip uh, standard tools file. Since this is a seven zip file, you'll also need to download seven zip. And if you're running a 64 bit, you need to download the 64 bit version. After Extracting the file in 7-zip, go ahead and right-click ST212, click Properties, go to Compatibility. We're going to run this program in compatibility mode for Windows 7. Then click Apply, then click OK. And now you can run the application. Language. Click next. Click accept. You're going to leave all the default settings except for the last page in which you will uncheck all four of these boxes. Click OK. We're going to be using your OBD. COM1. And then click install. After it finishes installing, click no, you don't want to restart the computer now, we'll do it later, and then click finish. Next, you'll want to navigate to your C folder. And you're going to want to delete these three folders and we're going to replace them. So you're deleting EC apps, EDI, ABAS, and NCS expert. Now we're going to replace those three that we just deleted with the three that we unzipped from the file by copying and then pasting them back into the C drive. After copying over those three folders, next we're going to go into the OCX folder from the zip, unzipped 7-zip. Uh, Download. We're going to copy these three files out of the OCX folder. We're going to go back to our C drive. We're going to go to the folder Windows. And then you're going to go to the SysWow64 folder. And go ahead and paste those three files into that folder. Next, you're going to want to open up the command prompt. You want to run it as an administrator. And you're going to type in the following commands. They'll be listed in the uh, 
comments section or the just below the video on YouTube. After each command, you'll hit enter and you'll see this dialog box pop up. Click OK and you're done. Now that you're done with uh, the command prompt, what you're going to want to do is go ahead and take this BMW tools icon and drag and drop it onto your desktop. And inside of that folder is where all of the Impa and other tools uh, reside. And the uh, final thing you're gonna wanna do is set up your cable. So grab your cable, finally you're gonna wanna go to device manager after the cable installs itself, which will take a minute usually. You'll find the uh, under ports, USB serial port. Notice how it says COM3. We need to change that, so we're going to right click, go to properties, click on port settings, go to advanced. It needs to be set up for COM1, so choose, go to the top, choose COM1, and we want to decrease the latency, latency timer all the way down to one millisecond. Click OK. Click OK again. It should uh, take all the changes. You'll know because it will say COM1 right there. And you should be good to go. All you need to do now is reboot your computer. After rebooting, double click on BMW Tools. It'll open up this folder right here with INPA, NCS Expert, WinKFP, Tool32, pretty much everything you need. You double click on INPA. This is what you should see. You're ready to plug in the other end of your cable, the OBD port into your car and start uh, diagnosing or uh, doing whatever else you need to do.